Hi everyone, so in this video I'm going to be talking about the documentary project that I'm going to be working on. Uh, this is all a part of the journal entries that I'm going to be posting on here for every single project that I'm doing in my editing class at Ithaca College. Um, so with this video I'm going to be talking about my planning process for this documentary about girl skaters that I'm going to be doing. Um, not exactly done, obviously, you can see the timeline here, only about a minute in. Um, but yeah, this is going to be just talking about the planning process and uh, what I'm deciding to doing. So with this project, I have made a bunch of folders. We have six folders and um, in each folder we have interviews and we have different B-rolls for the skater project. So the way I decided to go about this was I want to do a participatory documentary style, which is where you hear the interviewer ask the questions and you um, will see the people respond and then you will see videos of them doing the actions that they're talking about. So this documentary focuses a lot on girl skaters and in particular girl skaters, um, one being a little more tomboy and others being more girly as you can see in this video she's wearing a tutu um and you can see her skating around and then here's the difference so this one this girl is wearing leggings and a t-shirt and this one is wearing a tutu and pink um so yeah when going through the footage since they are children it is really difficult because the interviewer it looked like had a lot of difficulty keeping the kids on task and keeping them interested and keeping them responding to the questions properly so I'm gonna have to mess around with that a lot because um, let me see if I can find her one of the girls name is Rels here she is so in her interview she had a lot of trouble staying focused. So within this entire video, she's kind of just laughing a lot. She's playing with all her animals and she's not really answering the question or at least restating it. So that makes it really difficult to make a cohesive story. But um, my goal is with this, I'm gonna go through all her interviews and I'm gonna try and find some kind of understanding of what she's trying to say and try and get her story told um i'm going to introduce each girl in the beginning with them skating around and maybe like a sequence of uh them skating just so you could see what they're doing and then maybe i'll do a um voiceover of who they are um and then what they're doing and what their passion is maybe i'll have them tell their voiceover through interviews i'll just layer it um but yeah, that's my goal. I'm probably, I'm just going to focus on the girls and skating and the difficulty that they feel skating in a, um, outside in a skate park where there's other people around and the fact that boys are predominantly skaters. So they have to deal with that kind of pressure at the skate park where there's other guys there that might give them a little trouble when they're trying to skate. Um, so I wanted to focus on that kind of point of the difficulty of skating. Also, they're really talented, so I think I'm just going to try and highlight as much as possible of them skating because their interviews are very all over the place. So, it is going to be a lot of B-roll shots throughout the doc and maybe some interviews layered over it, but not a lot of interview format where you're just going to see the girl and then her talking because they're kind of all over the place, so I'm going to have to do some work in cutting their sentences together to try and make a cohesive story. Um, but yeah, the footage is actually really good when it comes to B-roll, so that really helps. Um, here, you see the princesses skate, see they're wearing dresses and stuff, and the sun is setting. It's beautiful, so the shots are gonna be amazing to use. Um, but yeah, so that's my plan so far. My narrative structure is pretty much just gonna grow from the beginning where you meet the girls, and then towards the end where you start feeling for them. Um, and the middle is going to be a lot of like building their characters and understanding their stories. Um, but yeah, that's what I'm planning on doing. I will be posting another video about when it's done and the structure I ended up with and how I ended up editing it. But yeah, stay tuned for my other videos. I have about three more projects that I have to post about. And yeah, thank you for watching.